Growing up on an island uh, so close to the sea really brings a lot of calmness to your life. We're about 400 people living on the island and everybody knows everybody. So to be able to live in the middle of nature like that, it's, uh, it's everything to me. The landscape around here is coastline with many small naked islands, just bare rocks sticking off of the ocean. That's the inspiration for the name of the brewery, Nögnö, a poetic term from an old poem by Henrik Ibsen. Juniper as an ingredient has a very long tradition. The juniper gives antiseptic qualities to the brewing water, an important part of the old farmhouse brewing. Now the juniper is more of a flavor and aroma addition. My name is Edvard Hochtemo. I'm the head brewer at Nögnö. I started as a production manager, worked my shifts at the brew house also took over responsibility when it came to sourcing uh, ingredients and uh, tuning the recipes, creating new recipes and driving innovation. We are producing about 50 new products a year. Many of them are based on locally sourced ingredients. Of course the honey, the bees swarm around the house. It forces you to think in new ways to not just make the same beer over and over. The feeling that you get when you work with ingredients that are not necessarily common and uh, you just happen to make a product that stands out and tastes magnificent, that's an unbeatable feeling. A typical day for me is organizing production, making sure that we have the ingredients at hand. Our core portfolio consists of about 20 different beers, 80% of the volume that we produce a year, from lagers and Belgian blondes and saison through classic British beers like Bitter and Brown Ale, and also American IPAs and Imperial Stouts. I think the strength of our portfolio is the diversity. There's a beer for everyone in there. The last 20% that is produced here is one-offs and specialty beers. If you get to focus on what you have at hand and work with that, you're forced to be creative and then trying to make that into interesting and, of course, good products. Making beer has been a part of humanity for the last 10,000 years. And brewing has so many opportunities. And that's what I love about this work. Cool.